What is going on, my YouTube friends, my Patreon friends? How are we all doing today? How's everyone doing, man? It's cold as hell out here. Cold as hell out here in Southern Alberta. We got our first snowfall. Everyone forgot how to drive already. It happens. It happens. Uh, listen, my friend Katarina Nicole dropped another single of her upcoming project, EP record. I EP maybe I can't remember I can't remember uh Darkling this one's called interesting this one's a visualizer so I actually I reacted to Katarina Nicole's first drop from this project and I also had a really fun interview with her too that I will tag in my hat somewhere it'll pop up up here somewhere and uh, I would love if y'all checked it out man she's a really 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 nice really caring person with a really big heart and uh, I know this project means a lot to her and is uh she had to dig deep for this one, y'all. She had to dig really deep. And like the band went crazy with this one. Jordan Chase, the producer, went crazy on this one. Um, so I'm looking forward to this. I'm going to have the link to this video in the description box, y'all. If y'all like this, if y'all could show an indie artist some love, I would really appreciate it if we helped and gave her another view. Uh, let me pull this up and let's see what we got. Drums sound great. Hold on. It all sounds great, man. I really, I'm really digging these drums. It's like brighter toms than I'm used to for this uh, kind of style of music, I guess. Um, but they stand out like really nice. I really am enjoying that. Obviously, a huge snare drum, man. I know how my buddy Jordan gets down. I know how he gets down. Uh, the vocal transition was cool. It felt like we had like a really heavily affected vocal into like a really nice, clean and like harmony driven vocal. I like that. <laughs> Harmonics are tough, man. That's a great riff. It's giving me like Bre Breaking Benjamin or something. I like that. I love a clean vocal. Like a clean pop sensibility vocal on top of something this tough is just warms my heart, y'all. Warms my heart. That like, I don't know if that's like a room mic or a talkback mic. That boo, boo, da, boo, boom, boo, boo, da, before the beat like dropped back in. I felt like that was going on during that last verse as well. Kind of like talked in the background. I feel like I was hearing something like that in the background. Let me see if I can catch it just in this exposed part again. <laughs> Nice bass drop too. Bridge 
section. Tough, man. A sweet, sweet uh, logo there. Katarina Nicole. Yeah, killer song. Hey, there's my reaction. There's my reaction to the last one. <laughs> killer song, man. Like I say, like as far as catchy vocals and ke catchy melodies go, and on top of a hard riff, man, like what else do you need? What else do you need, right? Let, and like taking out the lyrical content because I didn't really like follow it along. It's not... I it's more of a me thing. I just not really a top down listener. Um, I'll have to listen to it a hundred times to understand what all the lyrics mean and everything. But like the way they fit, the way that track went, the way the track walked, like it felt real smooth, real easy to listen to, hard hitting, big sections. I dug it, man. Something about a guitar that goes. Bleh, 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 bleh. <laughs> I always vibe with it, man. I always vibe with it. Shout out to the whole team. Shout out, a shout out to our friend Katarina Nicole, man. I'm gonna have the link to this video in the description box, and I'll, I'll, the podcast thing will be up here from the beginning. But I'll put that in the description box too, if y'all want to get to know Katarina a little more. And uh, catch y'all on the next one. <laughs>